I got a stingray hickey. You can yank on it, pull on it, swish it around. <laughs> Put it in your blood. Perfect. <laughs> and like, and got my belly. Ashley, I'm a circus artist currently performing in Dual Reality on board Virgin Voyages Valiant Lady. Uh, today we're at sea. We have open training in the Red Room and then we have a show tonight, which will be fun. We had cabin inspection this morning, I had breakfast, read my book outside, went for a little bit of a walk. Um, I'm gonna chill out in my cabin for a little bit. I can't decide if I want to play Crash Bandicoot or if I want to watch the rest of Love is Blind on Netflix. My setup right now. Love is Blind season three, Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> I'm off to the red room for some hula hoop training during open training because we've got open training in the red room which is really nice and it's the first one in a while so I'm excited to do some hoop drills. <laughs> I get your head. I was getting ready for the show, um, and one of our performers have just tested positive for COVID, which sucks. So that means I need to go down and get a PCR test. So this is a turn of events. It's just you know, it's the world we're living in, it's no one's fault. We're probably gonna have to do a reblock. Hopefully no one else has it and we can reblock the show before tonight. But I'm gonna pop down to medical with this lovely blue liner that I've just put on and let's hope we don't have the vid. I'm back, had my swab, and now we've gotta wait 30 minutes for our results. It's always just as you forget that we're still at the tail end of this whole pandemic and and then surprise <laughs> but i'm gonna prepare and keep getting ready anyway um because as long as everyone else is good i believe that we're gonna power through and put on a show today because that's what we do that's what we do hot tip the best way for the most secure high pony you will ever have in your entire life it's to attach two hair ties together, we all know the, the trick, and a bobby pin on each side. I do one hair tie just to get it all together. You slide the bobby pin in, like underneath, underneath the hair tie, and then we're going to wrap her. We're going to wrap it super tight, wrap it all the way around as many times as it will go. And then you slide the bobby pin back through. And I swear, I've never had a high pony more secure in my life. She's not going to move. Double shows. You can yank on it, pull on it, swish it around, and it'll stay. For extra luck, I do it twice. And then if you want, you can take the like placeholder hair tie out. I leave it in because then it makes it nice and thick. And then we're doing my braid. Half an hour, when did I go in for my test? Oh god, I hope I'm negative. Jeez, my braid's getting long. I did get a package. I got a package. Shall I open it? I've got 10 minutes. An Instagram ad got me. Ooh, Evora. It's a watch kit. And, oh, and I can change the colors of the watch it looks very cute and I impulsively bought one okay the watch setup is a little more complicated um, it is 5 58 I'm gonna go to the red room and 
I probably will not vlog pre-show just because we will be in a serious reblock if the show's happening and yeah that's just gonna be full focus <laughs> We did a show. We we did the reblock. We did the show and the show went well. It was great. I'm now gonna quickly change, grab something to eat, and then gonna go to On the Rocks to listen to free labels. <laughs> I just got back on the ship and had a shower so we are on standby for the show today and another one of our performers isn't feeling well and they have to wait to go to medical this afternoon so if they are fit for duty we are doing the show if they are not fit for duty then we're gonna postpone the show to later on this voyage so I'm not gonna start getting ready just yet I'm gonna go grab a coffee and a croissant. I feel like I need a little snack. Um, and then either way, we're gonna have a rehearsal of some sort at six o'clock, which is our call time. So regardless of if there's a show or not, we will be in the red room at six. Okay, it is 5.30 and we haven't heard an update. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup anyway. And then at six o'clock, I'll head to the red room for either a rehearsal or show call. I just don't want to be unprepared because usually for show call I like to have my hair and makeup done beforehand and then I warm up and do my thing and get ready for the show. So I would hate to not do it in case we're not doing the show and then be out of whack for my show call. So I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to do my face and then fingers crossed we do a show today. Otherwise it'll happen another day this week which is totally fine and it's just the nature of what we're doing. Oh, also I set up, I finally set up my watch and these are the colors that I've selected. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Show's been postponed. Great, I don't have to do blue eyeshadow. <laughs> okay, not great that the show's been postponed but great that I haven't gone too far in with my face.
Tuesday, we're in San Juan, Puerto Rico. Today we have the day off, we're in Puerto Rico, we're gonna have fun. Our show has been moved to Thursday, which is the same day as Scarlet Night. So we're just, we're gonna keep vlogging this week. <laughs> Alright, but I'm late and I've gotta head to the gangway. They're closing the door for us. <laughs> Day. Uh, we're just at the beach now and um, this beach is not swimmable it is super dangerous um, but we're watching the sunset and then Corey, Vlad and I are gonna go out to dinner on land which will be nice because we only have to be back on board at 8 p.m. and for us it's 4 40 so we got four more hours so we'll get dinner on land today, which will be very nice. Now I'm gonna catch the sunset. Oh, this is cute. Can you go? So tired today and like it's 10 past 11 and I feel like I've been hit by a truck I'm gonna get a coffee I'm gonna go to the our Scarlet Night rehearsal and then I think I'm gonna chill and read my book like a really low-key day I think and then I'm gonna watch ship show tonight to watch the premiere of soon and Andy they're doing duo straps and I'm also I also haven't seen the new acts that are currently in ship show so that's all I have planned for today, and God, I'm just so tired today. Just so tired. Unfortunately, we have to cancel our second show for this voyage uh, due to injury and having people sick. We are three cast members down and in the time frame that we have, we just it just wouldn't be possible to put on a show today. Um, we've been in the Red Room this morning just working on other contingencies and things that we can plan and we've just got some training for the rest of this afternoon that I'm gonna train some hoop stuff and we're working more contingencies and you know, unfortunately this is how it goes sometimes. Um, I was expecting this week to vlog our regular show week and this is definitely not a regular show week, but sometimes sickness happens, injury happens and we have to work around it. So that's a big shame, but I'm gonna go train some hula hoops. I still have Scarlet Night tonight and Circus Disco. Not tomorrow, but the day after, so still like bits and pieces of performing, but yeah, 
Dual reality is my favorite, so it's always a shame when we can't put it on. Um, but hi. <laughs>
Put in your block. Perfect. <laughs> Put in your block. Yes. Scala night, baby. <laughs> Happy Friday. Today is a sea day and it's been a pretty chilled one because today we also have off so it's a no-show day and we're at sea. But I had a really lovely afternoon tea with the girls and with Corey and then we had cake for Corey's going away because Corey, our athletic trainer, is leaving us, which is sad. But we have Jen who's going to be our new athletic trainer for the next couple months so that will be fun. And then, yeah, so no show tonight, but I'm gonna go outside, get some fresh air, maybe watch the sunset. Tomorrow's gonna be fun, because I've booked a crew tour in Bimini to see the Stingrays, and then I'll be performing in Circus Disco tomorrow. And then that will finish off this voyage, which has been, unfortunately, not a typical voyage. <laughs> It's not been the usual work week, but we are human and sometimes sickness and injuries happen and they can be, you know, un unavoidable sometimes. And unfortunately this week we had to cancel a show, which we hate doing, like we do not like canceling shows, but um, yeah, unfortunately this time around we had to cancel a show, which sucks because we love doing our jobs and we love performing, but it just happens and hopefully next week we'll have everyone back and we'll be able to do a great show next week that's what we're hoping for and I'm sure that will be the case this week's just been a bit all over the place <laughs> but sometimes that's what it's what life is sometimes life is all over the place and can't be predicted I'm gonna catch the sunset It's Saturday. We're in Bimini. We're in Bimini. And what are we doing? Um, we are about to swing with things that can kill you. No, <laughs> yes. Being we dramatic. Could, no, we're no, going no, on no. a stingray no, tour. It's going to be beautiful. It's going to be fun. It is a They're going to be our friends. It is a reason that those things live in the water and we live in the earth. You know? You? Separation. <laughs> <laughs>
I ended up getting a little kiss, a little hickey from the stingray. <laughs> the lucky one. The lucky hey, one. So Is that lucky? What happens if they kiss 14 me? years. <laughs> Double. Seven years of good luck if you kiss them. 14 if they kiss you. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. That's extra luck. <laughs> I'm back on the ship, it's like 4 p.m. in the afternoon. So we went on a stingray tour. We took a boat to Gun Key, which is like a small island off of Bimini. And you know, we got to swim with the wild stingrays. I got a stingray hickey. <laughs> I swear it was the stingray. I was kneeling in the water because we were like just off the shore and he swam up thought I had food I guess and like and got my belly and now I have a very nice hickey from a stingray so this is my stingray hickey I'm not like I'm not mad or upset or like anything about it I was swimming with wild stingrays and he thought I had food and I didn't so uh, a little takeaway a little takeaway from the adventure <laughs> I came back early, back on board's only six o'clock for us in Bimini, but because I spent like all day in the sun, I think I got almost a little bit too much sun. I thought I'd come back and chill out because tonight I'm performing in Circus Disco. So I just wanted to make sure that I had enough like rest time and chill time before getting ready for the show. Ah! 